Have you ever felt like your feet have embarked on a solo expedition to the Arctic? Like they've been submerged in a glacial lake and left to brave the cold alone? If you've nodded along, you're not alone. We've all had those days when our feet feel like they're encased in blocks of ice, especially after a long day of standing or when the weather decides to take a NOSA DV. But here's the good news. You don't have to endure this discomfort. There's a secret remedy hiding in plain sight in your kitchen that can metamorphose your icy feet into cozy retreats of warmth. And no, it doesn't involve sticking them in the oven, though the thought might be tempting on particularly chilly days. This magical elixir? Ginger. Yes, you read that right. This unassuming spice isn't just for adding a kick to your stir fry. It's a dynamo when it comes to heating you up from the inside out, and that includes your frostbitten feet. Now close your eyes for a moment and imagine this. You're on an untouched beach, the white sand squishing between your toes, the gentle sound of waves caressing the shore. The sun is warming your skin, and a cool breeze carries the scent of exotic flowers. Sounds heavenly, doesn't it? Well, guess what? A ginger foot soak can create a similar experience for your feet, minus the airfare. Intrigued? Let's dive into how to create your own tropical foot oasis right at home, creating your foot paradise. First things first, you'll need to gather your ingredients. Fresh ginger root is a versatile spice that offers a variety of health benefits. The fresher, the better. Epsom salts, despite the name, aren't actually salts, but rather a magnesium sulfate compound. They've been used for centuries for a variety of purposes, and while some of the benefits are debatable, they do offer some potential advantages. It's your relaxation champion. Sea salt is often touted for its health benefits compared to table salt. It's best for some added detox magic. Essential oils are concentrated plant extracts that have been used for centuries in aromatherapy, a form of complementary medicine that uses smell to promote health and well-being. It's optional, but a delightful addition. I recommend lavender for a calming effect or peppermint for a refreshing feel. A large pot or basin, hot water, be careful not to make it scalding, a comfortable towel. With your ingredients at the ready, let's get started. Slice your ginger root thinly. Don't worry about perfect slices. The magic lies within, not in the presentation. Now toss those ginger slices into your pot of hot water. Bring it to a boil, then let it simmer for about 15 minutes. This allows the ginger to release its warming properties into the water. While the ginger concoction works its magic, fill your basin with hot water. Not too hot, you want it to be comfortably warm. Here comes the fun part. Add in your Epsom salts and sea salt. These will not only help to relax your muscles, but also gently exfoliate your feet, leaving them feeling smooth and soft. Once the ginger water has simmered, it's time to create your foot paradise. Strain out the ginger slices. You don't want any surprises tickling your toes. Carefully pour the ginger water into your foot soak basin and mix it with the hot water you already added. Now, for the extra touch of luxury, optional but highly recommended, Add a few drops of your chosen essential oil, lavender for a calming experience, or peppermint for a little invigorating pick-me-up. Give it a good stir, and voila, your ginger foot soak is ready to transport your weary feet to a tropical haven. The bliss of a foot, soak, ah, isn't that better? Feel the warmth seep into your toes, spreading up your ankles and calves. Close your eyes and take a deep breath. Inhale the calming scent of the ginger and essential oils. Imagine the stress of the day melting away with each passing moment. Imagine your feet feeling lighter, looser, like they haven't carried the weight of the world on their shoulders all day. For the next 20-30 minutes, this is your time to unwind. Grab a good book, put on some relaxing music, or simply close your eyes and let your mind drift away. If you want to take your relaxation to the next level, give yourself a little foot massage while you soak. Gently rub your toes, knead your arches, and work your way up your ankles. This will further improve circulation and release any built-up tension. As you soak, feel the ginger working its magic. It's known to improve circulation, which can help to warm up those cold feet and leave you feeling energized from the inside out. Plus, 
the Epsom salts are working their muscle-relaxing magic, and the sea salt is gently exfoliating away any dead skin cells. By the end of this soak, your feet will be thanking you. The After Soak Glow After 20-30 minutes of pure bliss, it's time to say goodbye to your tropical foot paradise. Carefully remove your feet from the basin and pat them dry with a soft towel. Now, slip on your favorite pair of cozy socks. These will help to retain the warmth and keep your feet feeling pampered. And there you have it, a simple ginger foot soak that can transform your tired, achy feet into happy, healthy havens. So next time your feet are feeling the chill or the stress, remember the power of ginger. This little root packs a big punch when it comes to relaxation and rejuvenation. Who knows, you might even forget you're not actually on a beach somewhere, sipping on a tropical cocktail, although that does sound like a fantastic idea for another day. With that said, thanks for watching and until next time, take care of those fabulous feet. Hey everyone, before I let you go, I wanted to share a few bonus tips and variations to take your ginger foot soak to the next level. Tip number one, amp up the aromatherapy. We mentioned essential oils as an optional ingredient, but let me tell you, they can truly elevate your foot soak experience. If you're looking for some additional aromatherapy options, here are a few ideas. Chamomile is another great choice for relaxation. For a more spa-like feel, try adding a few drops of bergamot or ylang-ylang. If you don't have essential oils, no worries. You can create a similar effect by spritzing a little diluted witch hazel around the basin. Just be sure not to get it directly in the water. Tip number two, the power of touch. We talked about giving yourself a foot massage during your soak, but you can take it a step further. For an extra dose of pampering, try incorporating some acupressure points into your massage routine. There are specific points on your feet that correspond to different organs in your body. By gently applying pressure to these points, you can promote relaxation and even alleviate headaches or stomach aches. A quick internet search will reveal plenty of foot reflexology charts to help you locate these pressure points. It's a great way to soak your feet from relaxation to rejuvenation. Tip number three, spruce up your soak. Let's get creative. There are a few ways to customize your ginger foot soak depending on your mood and needs. Feeling a bit congested? Throw in some dried chamomile flowers or eucalyptus leaves for a soothing steam. For a touch of luxury, add a scoop of coconut milk to the water. It'll leave your feet feeling silky smooth. If you have achy muscles, consider adding a few slices of fresh cucumber to the water. Cucumber has natural anti-inflammatory properties that can help soothe sore muscles. The final touch. No matter how you choose to customize your soak, remember to end your foot pampering session on a high note. Brew yourself a cup of calming herbal tea, light a scented candle, and settle in for a good book or some relaxing music. Let the warmth and rejuvenation from your foot soak continue to work its magic. So there you have it. With a little creativity and these bonus tips, you can transform your ginger foot soak into a truly personalized and luxurious experience. Remember, self-care is essential and your feet deserve some pampering too. So go forth, soak your stress away and enjoy the warm, rejuvenating power of ginger. Thanks for joining me today and until next time, take care. I hope you found this video helpful and informative. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and leave a comment below. I would love to hear your thoughts and opinions. And if you want to see more videos like this, make sure you subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to get notified whenever I upload a new video.